Let's say we start with the BS. There's a major crisis in the RP community. It's not masculinity. It's not a lack of intelligence. It's not money. And it's not fitness. It's friendly fire. Friendly fire, huh? Friendly fire. Let me break this to you. Friendly fire. Red pill community. Let me break this to you. How, how, how is the red pill community? First off, many of you don't even consider MGTOW the red pill community. Which is the sector I'm a part of. So, rib, so friendly fire, huh? Let's see what you see. What you got to say. We've turned on each other. You see, over the last few years, men in this community have declared war on one another. Men are slandering each other, making personal information public. And turned on each other. Okay. Even doxing each other. This is flat out wrong. <laughs> The world does not care about men. It doesn't value our intellect. It couldn't care less about our plight. And it sure as hell doesn't care about what we contribute. So this community was created. Maybe if you check these some of these people, these grift, these the true grifters, these people that come into the community. Let me break this to you. You don't, many of you, all of you, if not every last one of you, have not come down to the scrum heap to discuss what's going on. So how are we, uh, how, what, what are you going to discuss? What have we got to discuss? You don't come down here. You don't come down to the sub thousand, the sub 500, the sub thousand community. Heck, you don't even come down to the, sub, to off your high, off your ivory tower to talk to any of us. To figure out what's going on. We see this stuff before you. Before you, Terrence Pop. Without all due respect, with all due respect, Sergeant, with all due respect, Top, we see this stuff before you do. You said a couple of years. This is going on a long time. This has been going on a lot longer than you've been catching on, big fella. Needed to give men a place to go for help. Help with money, fitness. Help? Help? What do you mean by help? Help with money? Fitness? So... How do you get them help with money? Have you, have you directed them to how, to how to get benefits for their children, for them and their families? How to get custody of their children? Do you even have a server on how to do that? Do you even know of a server on how to get, on how to get custody of their children back? Do you even know, do you, is there a server? Do you even know of a server? We got, well, like I said, to guarantee you the scrum heap has more connections, are more connected than you at your 10,000 level. At your level of 10,000 subscribers. You don't get off your views and your, you don't get your, get off your high horse for your views and your sub count to check on what's going on at the scrum heap. Yeah, you're right. Your eagles did get the better of you. Your 10,000 subscribers, 10,000 sub counts, your, ten, your, your million sub counts, your 10,000 views of a video got the better of you. Got the better of you. Help with how to be a true gentleman. True gentleman? Hey, wait, wait, wait a second. Isn't that what got us in this mess in the first place? Of being a true gentleman? Dealing with life as a veteran. Dealing with life as a veteran. Huh. How dealing with life as a veteran. Well, I will give you that one. Because as a fellow veteran, I want to tell you something here. I have been dealing with life as a veteran for years. So I'm pretty sure I, I I'm not of a up up the top high honcho, right? Let's go. Taking their place as head of household in a Western society, taking their place as head of household. 
and I bet you it like oh, count the bottles. Dear goodness, one, two, three in a glass. Even assistance with coping with divorce. And for a few years, things were awesome. Men banded together to help one another. We were thriving. We were. Your sector. There's two sectors of the manosphere. Whether you don't understand it, which you, you have failed to failed to mention. There are two sectors of the manosphere. There's the social sector, which is pretty much the lower sector. And then there's your sector. The, grand, the, the, the basically grandfathered in sector. You don't come down to the, to the social sector. You don't come down to the scrum heap. Because if you would have come down to the scrum heap and see the stuff that is going on that has been hidden from you, you'd understand that this stuff is more messed up than you think. And, it, and all this fighting has to happen because you got these PUAs that are basically shafting and not doing anything for men. So if you want to continue, you want to talk about that. Making real progress. But something changed along the way. Our egos somehow got the better of us. No, your subscriber and your view count got the better of you. That's what happened. Your subscriber and your view count got the better of you. That's what happened. I'm going to pause this here. Yeah, pretty much. You let your view and your subscriber count get the better of you. You let your high, you let yourself get posted on your high horse. You know, you let yourself get posted up on your high horse. And now it's coming back to bite you in the tail end. Oh, this community used to be so connected. Well, in order to be connected, you've got to basically get rid of the grifting people. The people who will literally grift, who will literally graft themselves as a part of the, a part of the manosphere to get money off of men. We become envious of one another. We start throwing around wild accusations. We started calling each other grifters, doing hit pieces on one another. And eventually, the message was lost. If you don't take care of the freaking message, well, well, first off, let me break this to you. That was never, the message was, was bound to be lost because you got too many people, like the PUAs, the PUAs, look, look, let me break this to you. Look who they got representing MGTOW. Look who they got representing Red Pill. You've got jack wagons like they're a pickup artist. That don't care about the message. You've got some people that have MGTOW in their title that don't care about the message. So you wanna you wanna basically say that there's there needs to be solidarity. How? How? We were constantly under attack. Since this first since before the first ad apocalypse. Solidarity. Solidarity. Are you out of your frickin' mind? Gentlemen, we are no longer a unified community. We were never a unified community. Never. When were we ever a unified community? Never. Never. We were never a unified community. If we were such a unified community, that debacle with CNN and Big John would have never happened. You would have had, you, you would have at least had his back. Every other week there's a petty disagreement. This creator falling out with that creator. And he copied me. Oh, he disrespected me. I said that first. He's the Oh, oh, really? This is what, this is what you're going with? No, it's not. It's, 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 you know how many times I get copied? I don't complain. Let me break this to you. When you cost somebody money and a lawsuit gets gets pushed, and, 
Man, you don't even know. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know what the funny thing about it is? These people claim that they don't, they're don't. they at the top, but they keep watching the bottom. Well, interact with us, you chuckle fornicates. Talk to us every once in a while. I'm pretty sure there are a lot of us that would be glad to have you on our channel. And that's not for the views. Mr. Products? He's a fraud. He should do a response video. <laughs> this ends right here and right now. No, it does not. You know why it doesn't end right here, right now? I'm gonna tell you why. Because y'all don't come down to the to, to the to the to, to the sub thousand count level, the scrum heap. Y'all don't come down to the scrum heap. If you don't come down to the scrum heap. And live physically, and literally, physically, and literally talk to us, it don't end. So go fornicate yourself. What you about to do? What you about to do to make it end? What you feeling to do? What's your plan? Oh, look, the bad of brothers. I wonder how much it pays with this production crap. Come on. Get on with it. Get on with it. And fatherhood. We'll talk about fitness and why fitness. We'll talk about how to avoid the wrong type of women. How to man. And man, man, I'm undefeated. Shit, I'm not. I've taken a lot more L's than W's. All right, let me stop the cat. I've taken plenty of L's. But many of us understand that it's not all about women. In fact, it's quite the opposite. This doesn't mean we don't want women. The scrum heap has been saying this crap for years. Certain sectors of the scrum heap has been saying this for years. Has been saying it for years. But y'all, but y'all, y'all just now, y'all just now getting a hold of this. Y'all just now getting wind of this. See, this is why they call me wind. This is why they call me the, the person who fights giants. I don't care how big your subscriber count is, I'm going after you. Piss off. Because trust me, we most certainly do. But we're going to show you why it's important to follow the advice of the Godfather himself, Rollo Tomasi. Rollo Tomasi ain't been the same. Ain't been, ain't been the same for a long time. Rollo Tomasi's on this high horse too. Tell it. Look here, each and every one of y'all, get off your high dag on horse, and and see what the scrum heaps like. Get a tour of the scrum. Get a tour of sub sub thousand subscribers remember this you were once there yourself you were once where a bear where a barren yam was you were once where a MGTOW in the wind was you were once where every beginning freaking content creator was that is to make yourself your own mental point of origin none of us are perfect far from it yes we have all made mistakes in life we have all made and you continue to make mistakes by not interacting with the scrum heap. Continue. And you're going to continue to make these mistakes by staying on your high horse. Bad decisions. We've all had our hearts broken. We've all been broke. We've all been through some shit. But our goal is to teach you how to avoid these pitfalls so that you can become the very best version of yourself. Yes, we will have disagreements from time to time. Well, well you're missing something with very best version for yourself yourself. I don't do it for anybody but myself. Let me break this to you. It's 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 like it's not for yourself. It, version of yourself. It's best version, best version of yourself for yourself. But in the end, we are all on the same team. We're in this together as men, and this is how. Tell that to the PUAs. Tell it up to the pickup artist. The ones that twist my words. The ones that literally twist people's words to, you know, to further their own agendas. Tell that to the people who come in a freaking MGTOW, don't even know, don't even know the goddamn the flavor of the Kool-Aid, but yet got the nerve to say, hmm, this Kool-Aid tastes like grape because it's yellow. 
it starts. The inaugural Conference of Masculine Excellence will usher in a new era in this men's community. And from here on out, we're going to do things differently. No more infighting. No more friendly fire. No more hit pieces. No more response videos. And no more public feuds. If we have... No more? What you gonna do? Disagreement. We handle it behind the scenes, man to man. The way it's supposed to be done. How, well, how you gonna enforce that? You gonna come down to the scrum heap? There's a reason I'm pissed off. Because for years y'all been on your high horse. You're just not seeing us? Talk to some of these people at the lower subscription level. And stop leaving, you know? You ever heard of this thing? I mean, Terrence Pop heard of this. Never leave a man behind. Well, of course, then I was prior service Marine. You never leave a freaking man behind. And it's as simple as that. Now more than ever, men need each other. In the end, we are much stronger united than divided. So join us on June 4th in Las Vegas to revive a once thriving men's community that focuses on its original purpose, helping men to become the very best versions of themselves. Thank you. How much is this gonna cost to get it to be a part of this? Oh my goodness. Cause I, I'll see if I can, I mean, shoot. If I got a delivery, if I, if I can convince my dispatch to send me to Las Vegas to see this crap, oh, heck yeah. How much are the tickets there, big fella? How much are the tickets? Come down to the scrum heap. This is MGTOW in the wind. I literally just gonna brown. I mean, I, let me know how you how, what you think it is. Actually, let me know how you think it is. Friendly, is it friendly fire? Or is it is it is it righteous criticism? Your decision. I don't care anymore. I'm I'm now now I'm now I'm really gonna start going after people until they come down and say something to me. I'm going to continue to do what I do, signing off.